Donnie once again here on Paring Donnie Vlogs. And for today's episode, we're going to discuss some of the topics that will come out in the quiz next week for my grade 6 students. So I hope my grade 6 students are watching this video. This is in relation to the, pre or in preparation I should say, for the upcoming quiz next week. And the topic for today, or for tonight, <laughs> is actually the First World War. All right, so I'll be all right. So I'll be giving you a summary, or a, a recap, a recapitulation of what we had discussed for the prior weeks. And uh, we'll start with how it all started. So the First World War started with the following, or with the variety of causes. So we will try to distinguish two causes, the main cause, or should I say the long-term cause, and also the short-term cause. Now, let's start with the long-term cause. So I'll have with an A, with an I, and with an N. So that's militarism, alliances, imperialism, and nationalism. So you have to remember that before the war broke out, so it's a long-term cause, there was already this particular conflict or this particular uh, spark or issues that needs to be settled in order to avoid a war. Eventually, it did not happen. But anyway, let's talk about the mountain. But anyway, let's talk about the main. Militarism refers to when the when the government gives or when a particular military is has been given a power by the government, okay? To to definitely to upgrade, to develop and to make sure that they improve their um uh, capability with the military forces, all right? And and that's just a a, a very brief um um, identification of militarism so all remember in which um, in which the military or when the army is given a high profile by the government okay so when an army so you have to remember that that is the concept of militarism now let's proceed to main or to letter a and that's alliances so we have um, uh, discuss about alliances it's like friendship it's like um, understanding or should I say agreement between nations okay now for the alliances in in uh, in relation in uh, in relation to the first world war there was actually a an alliance that was created for the purpose of balancing the power so they created an agreement we call uh, they actually call this um, uh, alliances number 1 the triple alliance the second one the triple entente now let's talk about the triple alliance the triple alliance composed of the following nations we have Germany, Austria-Hungary, and also it Austria-Hungary and also Italy. And the triple intent, intent I should say, that's the correct pronunciation of France would, France would. All right. So the triple intent um, comprises of uh, France, Great Britain, and also Russia. All right. So. Those are the alliances that were created for the purpose of balancing the power and eventually having an, an idea or having an idea for the purpose of balancing the power and eventually having an, an idea or having an objective that they would definitely stop any, any conflict or even not create any war. Eventually, unfortunately I should say, it did not went well all right so let's pr now let's talk about imperialism imperialism is actually taking or the concept of imperialism is taking over new lands there was a crisis in 1904 and also in 1908 where in in a balkan state where there, there was a conflict or a crisis between france great britain versus germany talking about the moroccan and the boston crisis Lastly is nationalism. Nationalism is uh, actually uh, an idea or the concept of being a strong supporter, a strong supporter of, of, of the right of one's country. So, th so those comprises or summarizes the main causes of the First World War. M for militarism, I or A alliances, I imperialism, and letter N nationalism. Now let's proceed to the short term cause. And this happened on June 28, 1914 or 1914 in a visit to Sarajevo in Bosnia when the Archduke Franz Ferdinand of Austria-Hungary um, planned a visit to the to the troops 
And this is again, to, to summarize everything, he was assassinated by a group of um, terrorists from Serbia. They, uh, they, they call themselves the Black Hen. Seven of them are actually members of uh, this particular group. And because of that, um, war was inevitable, inevitable, and it was really about to happen. When Austria-Hungary declared a war on Serbia, when the uh, past, eventually, because of alliances, Germany, France, Russia, Great Britain, and most of the rival alliances, eventually, unfortunately, declared war.